Today we're gonna to go over hip airplanes, all right? You probably want something to give yourself a little support. We're gonna use a chair, you could use the wall, you could use a box or cable, anything else that is around you, all right? The idea is not to try to make it as challenging as possible, but to actually feel you controlling the joints through a full range of motion. So I'm gonna start on my right leg, all right? I'm gonna bring my hands down, I'm gonna reach my other leg out behind me. I wanna to try to keep a pretty neutral spine throughout. Now the big thing that I'm focusing on is keeping this foot planted and slightly bent. All right, my butt back. I'm gonna then start to open my hip up to the ceiling, hold it, and then slowly roll it back down. All right, and I'm gonna show you from this angle because you can see, right, my, if I had a flashlight on my left hip, I wanna turn it up to the ceiling, and then I wanna actually try to turn it back down almost across my other shoe to the floor. And what I should feel is the outside of this hip, standing leg, doing a good amount of work, maybe even getting a little stretch. Again, take these slow, they're not meant to be fast. You're trying to actually feel control by exploring the full range of motion, right? Pushing through the floor on the standing leg and controlling the pelvis by all the musculature on the outside of the right leg. 